Hey everyone! Today, we're diving into the incredible world of Nobel Prize winners in medicine. These brilliant minds have reshaped our understanding of life sciences. So, buckle up as I take you through the years. Starting with 2001, we have Leland H. Hartwell, Tim Hunt, and Paul Nurse. Their research on the cell cycle was groundbreaking. They discovered key regulators of the cell cycle, which are crucial for understanding cancer. Fast forward to 2002, Sidney Brenner, H. Robert Horvitz, and John E. Sulston were awarded for their discoveries concerning genetic regulation of organ development and programmed cell death. Their work provided insights into how cells self-destruct, a process that's essential in diseases like cancer and neurodegeneration. In 2003, Paul Lauterberg and Peter Mansfield introduced us to magnetic resonance imaging, or MRI. This technology revolutionized medical imaging, allowing us to see inside the human body in unprecedented detail. 2004 saw Richard Axel and Linda B. Buck take the stage. They uncovered the complex world of olfactory receptors, explaining how our sense of smell works. Imagine understanding how we can distinguish thousands of different odors. Jump to 2005. Barry J. Marshall and J. Robin Warren shocked the medical community by proving that peptic ulcers are primarily caused by the bacterium Helicobacter pylori, not stress or spicy food. This revelation led to new treatments and saved countless lives. Andrew Z. Fire and Craig C. Mello took the prize in 2006 for their discovery of RNA interference. This process can silence specific genes, offering new avenues for treating viral infections and genetic diseases. 2007's winners were Mario R. Capecchi, Martin J. Evans, and Oliver Smithies. Their work on gene targeting in mice provided a powerful tool for studying gene function and creating animal models of human diseases. In 2008, Harold Zurhausen discovered that human papillomaviruses cause cervical cancer. His discovery led to the development of the HPV vaccine, a major advance in cancer prevention. Elizabeth H. Blackburn, Carol W. Greider, and Jack W. Sostak won in 2009 for their work on telomeres and the enzyme telomerase. This research has profound implications for aging and cancer. 2010 celebrated Robert G. Edwards for the development of in vitro fertilization or IVF. His work has given hope to countless couples struggling with infertility. Ralph M. Steinman was posthumously awarded in 2011 for his discovery of the dendritic cell and its role in adaptive immunity. This has been crucial for vaccine development and cancer immunotherapy. In 2012, John B. Gurdon and Shinya Yamanaka were recognized for their work on cellular reprogramming. They showed that mature cells can be reprogrammed to become pluripotent stem cells, which can develop into any cell type. Jumping to 2013, James E. Rothman, Randy W. Sheckman, and Thomas C. Sudhoff unraveled the mysteries of vesicle trafficking, explaining how cells transport molecules efficiently. And that's a wrap for now. Each of these discoveries has propelled life sciences forward, offering new hope and treatments for countless conditions. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more amazing science content. Nature is ultimate.